Elisa Meredith, Content Marketing Manager at Tailwind here. I'd like to take you through the pin inspector in our dashboard. You're going to find out what these numbers mean and how you can use them to improve your Pinterest marketing strategy. Let's go. Here we are in pin inspector. What you're seeing are the last 5,000 pins that you've added to your Pinterest account, whether you pin them manually or you pin them through Tailwind. And when you pull it up, it's going to be be sorted by the number of repins, the highest at the top. But what you could do is filter by date pinned if you just wanted to look at a more recent showing of your pins. You could also filter here or sort by the date pinned if you wanted to see most recent pins. When you spot a winner, this is a good time to schedule a repin right now and add it to your tribes because you want more and more repins, more and more traffic from those pins. What I like to do in here is look for other people's content that I've pinned that's gotten some good results and see if there's something I should do similar. Oh yeah, so I should be writing an article about Pinterest SEO right now. I'll get back to you, <laughs> kidding. But that is a great topic, right? Obviously it's doing well on my Pinterest account. So I suspect it's a combination of the topic that is a hot topic. It has a nice little date on it. It's doing well. It was pinned at the right time also in December for 2018. And it's a very strong image as well. <clears throat> so I should be making pins like that. Now you can also filter here by category. These are Pinterest categories. If you want to do that, you can do a keyword search just to pick up certain keywords and you can do it by just one board at a time or you can look at pins that are from your own website. So we're gonna try that. These are pins just from my website and I have a tip from my friend Tina Gammon. When she sees pins from her own website that do well, I'm sure she reschedules and adds them to her tribes, but she will also create more content like that and she will spend the time to make more images for that content to get even more mileage out of her blog posts. So I hope that gives you some ideas on how you can use Pin Inspector to improve your own Pinterest marketing.